for shenanigans squad welcome to shy shenanigans it's your girl shy shenanigans back with another banger if you guys are new to this channel make sure you like comment and subscribe turn on your post notifications because you don't want to miss a beat did y'all hear me go before we get into this video make sure you like comment and subscribe turn on your post notifications because you don't want to miss a beat okay so guys today i'm outside right now as y'all can see i'm walking ori she's too excited right now today i am getting my hair done a couple days ago i got my lashes done can y'all see them are y'all feeling them <laughs> y'all need to stop playing and go book y'all appointment at or this girl meets by day on instagram get right y'all because baby i woke up like this period but today i'm about to get my freaking hair done and i'm so excited it's gonna be by a new hairstylist that's trying to um come down here and get her clientele up so she Inboxing and was like, I want you here. I'm like, yeah, let's do it. So I'm gonna go to my appointment around six o'clock and get my hair done. I'm gonna show y'all a little preview of what it looks like some way, somehow, right now. Like, I'll be over here. I'm gonna get that done, and I'm excited because I never had that hairstyle before. And she suggested that she wanted to do it, so I'm like, period, let's do it. Y'all just gonna come along with me throughout my day. Um, after I'm done walk Ori, I'm gonna start working out. So that's what this vlog's gonna be just a hair maintenance vlog and i'm excited i hope you guys are excited and let's get into the video Okay guys, I'm on my way to the gym now, as y'all can see. What I do uh, Monday through Friday is I work out, of course, and I start on my bike to warm me up, and then I walk this little trail and go to the um, leasing office where the gym is. So that's what I do Monday through Friday. Um, some days are easier than others. Today is one of those hard days because I had a bad day yesterday, I feel like, and I let my anger get the best of me, my anxiety. And I hate when I do that because the next day I always feel the repercussions of that. And my pastor has been telling me, you know, to just take it easy. Um, patience is virtue and to really work on my patience and stuff. And that's what God is teaching me right now. So I try to be positive about it. Um, and my advice to y'all is if y'all deal with like depression, anxiety, anger, stuff like that, PTSD, to just um, pray about it. God will do his big one on you and he hasn't forgotten about you and it's stuff that we got to work through. And just because somebody else has um, worked through it faster than you, they haven't been through what you've been through. Everybody dynamic is different. How people receive stuff is different. So just work it out with God, only, only God and know that you know he's gonna work it out for you no matter what no matter how it looks or nothing and don't be too hard on yourself know that he forgives you so it's nothing to really dwell on you know and i'm working through that because when i have my little episodes of anger and stuff like that i just um dwell on it a little bit longer than i should and i should just be able to let it go and know that that's not me that's just a spirit in me that god is working out of me so you know just be positive y'all just know that everything happens for a reason you're human we're only flesh and blood we all fall short sometimes and hold yourself accountable at the same time and don't let anything stop you from getting to where you want to be and know that when God has something for you and he has a blessing for you, it's for you and it's going to come regardless. So, y'all stay blessed. And remember, God got you through it all. And he loves you no matter what. Okay? But, that was my little chit-chat I had to put in here for us. 
wasn't having a good day, but now I feel better because I got it out and I got to speak to you guys. But we going into the gym right now and we about to get this workout in, so let's go. A few moments later. Okay guys, that was the end of my workout. I relieved some stress. Working out was important though, I'm trying to tell y'all. It's very important to work out because it's so many benefits. First of all, it relieves stress. You can get all your anger and frustration out with working out. It um, frees your mind really in a way too because my mind was very cluttered walking to the gym, but now that I'm walking out, I feel freer. You feel me, my mind is right and I can conquer my day now. So try starting your day with working out. Start off with God first though, read the word. 
do your daily devotion and then go work out okay because i start off with god i walk ori and then i work out and then i go on with my day and that usually consists of monday through friday after i work out i go home and i clean up if it's anything to clean and i go on bigo maybe some money make sure y'all follow me on bigo at shy shenanigans period i got another account too at shy dollar so follow both of those because those are the ones i'll be on the most take out my hair i still have um my braids in for my um soft lock so she had to do single braids so i gotta take those out so i'm gonna take out my hair first wash it get in the shower wash myself y'all come along with me and let's get it done I don't want to do it at all. Okay guys, I finally got all the braids out. I'm about to wash and condition it while I'm washing myself in the shower. And then I'm gonna get out and I'm gonna blow dry it, detangle it and all that. So yeah, yeah, stay tuned. Okay guys, I'm not an expert on how to blow my hair out. I just do what I just did. <laughs> so that's why it looks like this, but I'm beautiful either way. Hair is at its natural state and this is me. So I love me 100% because I'm made in God's image, period. I'm about to eat something really quick. So y'all stay tuned for the rest of this vlog, period. Much, much, much later. Here's the finished freaking look, baby. Eight fucking down. Do y'all see this? It's giving scalpy on a baby. <laughs> <laughs> she ain't come to fucking play. Shout your shit out. Give them the Instagram. Give them everything that you need to give them to know where to book a fucking appointment. Come on. <laughs> you can ask <laughs> My Instagram is styled by Amir. Mm-hmm. All that. And tell me, when are you going to be back in Houston? Because I need to know for my future reference, too. Come on. I'm going to come at the beginning of January. Beginning of January? I, <laughs> I, y'all got the tea. So don't act like y'all don't know where to go. Because y'all going to be looking at me like, Shy, where you at? No, I already said it. And it's going to be in the description down below. So don't come to me. Go to her. Book them appointments ahead of time so you don't miss out. Because, baby, this is the tea. Baby, this is the tea. I'm not playing. Don't say I ain't help y'all. But y'all, this is the end of this vlog. Thank y'all for watching the whole vlog. If you got to hear you a real OG, period. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Turn your post notifications because you don't want to miss a beat for the people on the back. If you guys are new to this channel, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Turn your post notifications because you don't want to miss a beat. I love you guys so much. Thank y'all for tuning to this video. Y'all stay blessed and I am out of here. Peace.